Good morning and welcome to my yoga corner. Happy Easter weekend. Easter weekend, beautiful weekend for practicing to open up to new possibilities and new beginnings. I picked us some cards this morning and this is from a beautiful energy deck by Sandra Ann Taylor. And actually two cards came out when I was shuffling the deck. The first one is Angel of Strength, personal power and inner strength. This is not the time to be passive or submissive, but to speak your truth and take action on your own behalf. You are capable of taking greater control and directing your own destiny for the power that comes from within reaches to the universe and beyond. Inner strength and unlimited resources flow through you at this time, helping you to create real results. And the second one that came out was patience. That's a hard one for us. <laughs> so this one, she the card is saying, let go of anxiety and be flexible. Be patient, open, and creative. Choose to be peaceful in the present. The universe has more options than you are aware of. Quiet your mind, broaden your perspective, and let them come through. Those were two perfect cards for what we're going through today. And we have to be a little more creative. Our life is, as we've known it is no longer at this time. So we have to be creative in how we live our life today. And having patience is a really challenging one right now because everyone wants to get back to their regular routines and jobs and life and including myself. But we're not able to right now. So with the acceptance of life as it is, then we can find our new beginning. So today we're going to do our Friday flow. But I felt that it was important just to do a gentle flow this morning. So grab your mat. And join me for a gentle flow. Begin the flow of breath through your nostrils. Breathing in for the count of five and exhaling for a count of five. Let's begin. Let's continue the flow of breath and add our body movement in synchronicity with the breath. So inhale, reach your arms up to the ceiling and exhale, twist to your right, left hand in front, right hand in the back, gaze over the right shoulder. Inhale, lift up. Exhale to the left. Inhale, lift. Exhale, right. Inhale, lift. Exhale, left. Let's do one more on each side. Inhale, lift. Exhale, right. Inhale, lift. Exhale, left. Inhale, reach up, meet the palms, 
Exhale to your heart. Find your breath, center yourself, and breathe. Let's place our right hand on the mat beside us, left arm over, and just take your gaze up to the ceiling, then let's flow to the other side. So let's inhale at the left and exhale at the right. Keep your breath flowing with your body. Inhale and exhale. Inhale and exhale. Just enjoy this flow. Let's do a few more. Just enjoying the synchronicity of breath and body moving together. And once again, bring your arms up, meet your palms, exhale to your heart. Beautiful. Let's take our legs out in front of us and tap out the tension. Inhale, reach your arms up and exhale, come into a forward fold. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, forward fold, go a little deeper. Inhale, reach. Exhale, fold. Inhale, reach. Exhale, a little bit further. Inhale, reach. Then take the body as far as you can, coming into forward fold. Stay here and breathe. Bring yourself up. Left foot into the right thigh. Right arm down the right leg. Inhale. Oh, sorry. Inhale as we move back. And exhale as we move forward. Inhale back and up. Exhale forward. Inhale up and back. And exhale forward. One more time. Inhale up and back. And exhale forward. Beautiful. Take it to the other side. I'm just going to turn around so my back isn't towards you. Right foot into the left thigh, left arm down your left leg. And bring it over for a stretch. And then let's start our inhale as we move up and back. And exhale, bring it forward. Inhale, up and back. Exhale, forward. And a couple more. Let's really enjoy the stretch in our body with our breath. And let's do one more. Stretch it up, bring it over, feel that deep stretch. Beautiful. Lift it up. 
Now we're going to go back into our forward fold and you should be able to go a little bit deeper in your forward fold now. So inhale, reach up, exhale, bring it forward. Inhale, reach up, exhale, bring it forward. Let's do one more. Inhale, reach up, take it as far as your body allows you and stretch. Beautiful. Good, let's bring ourselves up into our tabletop. So bring your wrists under your shoulders, your knees under your hips, spread your fingers wide tuck your toes beginning with a flow inhale gaze up slightly arch your back exhale gaze in round your spine and just begin this flow breath and body working in synchronicity gently mindful movement. Stay in your practice. Keep your mind on your body and what you're experiencing. Embody mind and emotions. Bring yourself back. We're going to start a flow between our cow and our child's pose. So we're going to modify this by coming into wide child's. Take the knees to each side of the mat, bring the big toes together. Modified cow on the inhale. And exhale, child's. Inhale, cow. And exhale, child's. I want you to do this a few more times. Inhale, cow. And exhale, child's. Feel that beautiful flow of breath. and body working together. Now bring it back to your cow. Let's take it from cow to our downward dog. So knees under your hips, tuck your toes in the mat, wrists under your shoulders, and inhale, gaze up, Exhale, come into downward dog. Inhale, back into your cow. And exhale, into your dog. Inhale, cow. Exhale, dog. Inhale, cow. And exhale, dog. Feel that deep stretch in downward dog. And now we're going to start a flow. We're going to modify. We're going to move into cow. Inhale in cow. Release the feet. Exhale in child. Inhale in cow. And exhale in dog. Inhale, cow. Exhale, child. Inhale, cow. Exhale, dog. Do a few more.
And let's end in our child's pose. Take a little breather. And let's bring it up. So this is a gentle flow, but you still might be feeling a glow. I am feeling a glow. <laughs> so we're going to bring ourselves up. So let's take it up. And we're going to start a flow in our chair pose. So sitting in chair pose, let's open up the chest here. Open up our lungs, the chest, and our breath. So I want you to sit back in your chair pose. And I want you to lift your toes slightly so you're back on your heels. Take your hands to your heart center. Inhale, gaze up to the ceiling. Open up the chest. Exhale. Bring it back to heart center. Let's do two more. Inhale, open up. Exhale, back to heart. Flow with the breath. Inhale, open. Exhale, back. Let's take it into a forward fold. Nice forward fold. Stretches the body, cools the body down. If you have low blood pressure or you feel dizzy with your head down, always keep your head at waist height. Bend your knees. Inhale, let's sit in our chair. Exhale, bring it into forward fold. Take the arms back and around. Let's float. Inhale. Sit in your chair. Exhale, forward fold, back and around. Inhale, sit in your chair. Exhale, back and around. And then just release your arms and ragdoll. Let go of the body. If you want to hold on to opposite elbows, do so. Or just let your arms just fall, just like a rag doll. Beautiful. Let's bring it back down to the mat. Take it into your butterfly pose, bringing the soles of the feet together. Good. Take the flesh off your sit bones. And we'll start a flow of breath. While sitting in your butterfly, allow your hips to open up, your knees come to the ground. Let's start a flow of breath with our arms. So stretch your arms out nice and wide. Take on the world. <laughs> Inhale, lift your arms up, meet your palms. Exhale to your heart. Inhale, stretch those arms out wide. Meet your palms. Exhale to your heart. And again, stretch it out. Feel those arms stretch out. Feel those arms stretch up. Bring your palms together and exhale to your heart. One more time. Inhale. And exhale. Beautiful. Let's open up our butterfly just that little bit more. Feel the hips open up. And we get a lot of, a lot of emotions get stuck in our hips. So it's really important that we spend time opening up that tight hip area. Let those emotions out. I know some people say, oh, phooey on that. <laughs> but it's true. <laughs> we keep emotions locked up, particularly in our hips. So um, I tend to have very open hips because I tend to let my emotions out, sometimes not appropriately. 
but I don't keep those emotions locked inside me because I don't want to lock up my body. So let yourself acknowledge those emotions and then release them, release them healthy. Maybe you need to write on paper or maybe you need to speak to somebody in particular, but let's try and keep our emotions balanced during this time. And just enjoy being in your butterfly. Follow your breath moving in and out of the body. Let's bring it into a forward fold in our butterfly. Beautiful, just end our butterfly stretch. Then let's take it down to the mat. I want you to lift your legs up to the ceiling. And just let your legs flow in circles. Just let your legs flow to the right. And flow to the left. And then let your waterfall just float. Just enjoy just being here. Gently take your feet down to your mat. Bring the feet together. Bring your knees together. Maybe just fold your arms in cactus arms or you can keep them outstretched wide. And let your knees flow from side to side. Very slowly and mindfully. Take your gaze opposite to your knees. Very mindfully. And just let it flow side to side. Bring it back to center. Release your legs. Bring your arms to your side. And now just let yourself float away in your savasana. Find yourself rested on the ground. Think about the cards that we chose at the beginning of class. 
tap into your inner strength. Inner strength you find when you are still. Choose to be peaceful in the present moment. Breathe in peace and exhale chaos. Just follow the flow of breath moving through your body. Feel the belly rise on your inhale and fall on your exhale. You're still experiencing the flow of this practice. Flow of breath and body working together in synchronicity. Belly lifts as you inhale. Belly falls as you exhale. Focusing on your breath and your belly. And just let that movement relax you. Beautiful. Let's awaken our body and stretch our body out while you're laying down. Stretch your arms from side to side. Stretch your fingers out nice and wide. Stretch your toes away from your body. And really give your body a nice deep morning stretch or afternoon whenever you're doing this video. And release your stretch and roll onto your side body. And then gently bring yourself up to your easy pose. And close your eyes. And I'm going to use the root chakra singing bowl to ground us for our day today. Let the tone resonate through your body, resting at the base of your spine and grounding you in this present moment. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti Om. Peace, peace, peace be with you.
Namaste. Have a beautiful day today. Enjoy your new beginning of Easter and celebrate with your family on house party or on FaceTime and just spend time with each other virtually and enjoy what we've been given, the technology we've been given to be able to do that at this time. So again, thank you for joining me this morning. Namaste.